It is a Rhineland city synonymous with carnival at the start of each year. Welcome to the great city of Cologne. My name is Derek Ray, and joining me in the commentary position is the former Arsenal and England fullback Lee Dixon. And very much looking forward to bringing you live action from the Bundesliga in a matter of moments. It is Köln up against Werder Bremen. Yeah, thank you, Derek. Real pleasure to be here. Looking forward to this game. Players will be a bit nervous. I was always nervous at the start of games. It's important you get your first pass off to your colleague, maybe get a good tackle in, settle the nerves down. Looking forward to a good game here. So the starting 11 for Köln. The wing backs are going to be crucial in this setup. You've played in that position, Lee. Yeah, I didn't really like it. And we always thought when we were playing against five at the back with the wing backs exposed like this in this formation, that a 4 4 2 can really create a 2v1 down the side. So keep your eye out for that. And the three narrow midfield players supply the support for the two forwards up front. And a look at the starting 11 for Werder Bremen. The goalkeeper of choice is Jerzy Pavlenka. Leonardo Bittencourt starts with Maximilian Eggestein in the centre of midfield. And the story in attack is one of a strike partnership. And the match is underway. Bittencourt. It's with Merwald. Augustinsson. Rashica. Kevin Merwald. Oh, he's really opened them up here. Are showing good patience. Eggestein. Every part. Can he take advantage? And a goal! Not wasting much time today. They strike first. Well, as we see again here, this really is patient, accurate, incisive passing at its best. And the relaxed way he strikes that into the back of the net is pure quality. One nil then. Tor for Werder Bremen. The number seven, Milo Rasica. Özcan. Emmanuel Dennis. Here's Duda. Duda. On and on he goes. Wonderful chance! And the keeper had the measure of it. Well, he's given a corner, the referee. Over it comes. Ball now. Looks promising this. Working away patiently, looking for an opening. Envis Rejbetsai. And he read it well. Augustinsson. Marco Friedel now. 
Spraying passes around, almost waiting for the opposition to make a mistake. Kevin Murwald. It's Rashica on the ball. It's with Murwald. Eggestein. Rashica. An alert intervention. Duda. Janes Horn. Emmanuel Dennis. And attempting the through ball. Not to be this time. Sergeant. Bittencourt in a position from which they could potentially do a bit of damage here. Keeping it moving dynamically. Intercepting it intelligently. Duda. The right idea with that pass. This could level it. And it is the equaliser. Parity now. And who's to say what's going to happen next? Well, here it is again. It's all about the pace in transition. They were so quick to get out from the back and he had choices of what type of finish to apply. And bang, he goes for the smash. Lovely goal. So, a level contest. 1-1. Bittencourt It's with Murwald Friedel Toprak And it's with Eggestein And can they prize them open now Kevin Murwald Ball with Bittencourt Rashica. It's with Murwald. Bittencourt. And it's with Eggestein. Kevin Murwald. So the whistle then. We're up the halfway stage in this match. He's been the standout for his side so far, don't you think, Lee? Well, he stepped up to the plate to get that goal to put his team on equal terms. Can he produce a winner in this second half? Let's find out. As anticipated, plenty of talking points so far. And now the second half is underway. Bittencourt. It's with Murwald. Velkovic. And here's Gebre Selassie. Eggestein. Kevin Murwald. Toprak. On the ball, Velkovic. Eggestein now with Toprak an important interception Özcan Duda here's Skiri a chance to whip it in Showing patience as well as persistence in the build-up. Ball now. Now can they make something happen? Elias Skiri. And Resh Betsai with it. Can they get in behind them? 
Well, he was in the right place to intercept. Sergeant. Rush. Useful looking ball. What a vital intervention. Duda. Skiri. Unable to keep the ball. We're now inside the final 20 minutes of the game. Kevin Murwald. Toprak. On the ball, Augustinsson. Rashica. And they'll get ready for the throw-in. And the substitution will occur now. Inside the last quarter. Emmanuel Dennis. Özcan. And it's Dennis. Dennis. How can they open up the defence here? Anderson. It's opening up for them. Ball now. And it's Dennis. It looks promising. Betsai with it. Now, oh, disappointing end to the move. Rashica. It's a good looking ball in behind. This could wrap it up. This is why we adore this game. Late drama, and now they're in front. Well, it looks like the game is over, but no, there's another chance. And there it is, back of the net. It looks like the winner. Well, here it is again. It's a lovely ball behind, perfectly timed. And when he gets through to the keeper, he just smashes it past him and gives him no chance to think. A lovely finish. So there we have it, 2-1. Well, just listen to the crowd. They want a bit more. They know there's still time to grab an equaliser. Surely they'll get another chance or two. So one minute of stoppage time. That's what the officials have said. Well, time is against them. They have work to do. Emmanuel Dennis. And there goes the final whistle. It's gone the wrong way as far as the home fans are concerned, Lee. Oh, Derek, play right to the end. Just when you think the game is over, that's when you should be switching the turbo concentration button on. It happens so often. Losing like that will really hurt a lot. Well, his performance in this particular game will have impressed many people, Lee. Well, he did have a good performance, didn't he? But it's all about snatching that late goal to grab the win.